Hello, your pilot here. I'll start one of my old uh, cockpit videos, GoPro videos. This is Airbus 340. I think we, it's a takeoff on the way to Beijing. Uh, for the background, I have been very busy lately uh, doing uh, uh, two podcasts, and I'm also working hard with my SCP license. Uh, SCP single engine piston rating making good progress not much left and uh, then I uh, will have the rating in my pocket I fly the Cherokee now which is a small plane very different from an Airbus 350 so I just have to tune tune in again to flare at a much much lower altitude and uh, yeah all the stuff you have to fuel yourself you have to pull out the plane from the hangar, it, it's very different. I like it very much because that's how my aviation career started. So now I am back flying small planes. Next step is the Saab Safir, which is my absolute favorite of all single engine piston planes. I flew it a lot in the Swedish Air Force. When I stopped flying in the VIG and I could fly the Saab Safir as much as I, I liked and I certainly did. I was in the Saab Safir from the morning until the evening. I have around 100 hours on it. So that's the next step. I love this plane. It has uh, the delicate um, flight characteristics. <laughs> Also recorded two podcasts uh, one with uh, travel news that's one is in Sweden I have recorded a YouTube about how we recorded the podcast I will publish it later and give you a link to that podcast but have also uh, produced a podcast together with the uh, inside flyer it's about a plane that look in the cockpit looks very similar to the Airbus 220 that's interesting and I found out that Bombardier has had helped the Chinese manufacturer to produce this plane and also it's that's why it's so similar in the cockpit. I asked on Instagram if people could guess what plane it was and almost all of them guessed that it was an Airbus 220. Well that, that was similar to Bombardier C series and that's the reason for the similarity. I have it here. The, I put the link for this podcast, the podcast is in English, I put the link in the, down in the description. I think you should listen to it. It's about how, how you, an aircraft manufacturer develop a plane and how it's, uh, the training is for it and how it usually is. Hope you find the podcast interesting. There are also some good news in the industry when the vaccine coming out now, rolling out and the, uh, the traveling is slowly picking up and I read today two articles about uh, very very strong demand for traveling. We're not there yet, still uh, some <laughs> time to get the full impact of the vaccine but it looks like it will be very, very strong demand for traveling in the future. That's interesting because uh, many of you are in the aviation industry. You want to book pilots and you want to work in the cabin and so. And things are really happening fast now. I think it certainly will do. Because of, remember, after every crisis comes a recovery. And I think this will be a very strong recovery. That's what I think. You can give your own thoughts in the comment section, please do. Take care, uh, follow my channel, thanks for subscribing. Uh, I recommend my old uh, landing and takeoff videos in my YouTube. You have to scroll down to find them, but I strongly recommend them. Take care. Okay, let's watch some air-to-air -air videos.